Hey everybody! It's been a while since I've done one of these, but I figured, you know, it's October. Well, October 12th. I've been a little busy with life. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna play a fucking horror game. I'm going into this one blind. It was recommended by the awesome, amazing good indie horror games curator, so. I'm just gonna go in. Apparently it's like 19 minutes long, so. Fuck it, man. Why not? December 11th, 1994. My brother Ethan is missing for around 24 hours. He went on a hiking trip near the Red Mountain. He should have come home yesterday. I went to the local police. And they said they don't have the resources for a search right now. So I decided to take matters into my own hands. Oh, cool Blade Runner music. Alright, let's, let's eat just fucking over. Oh, 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 I am controlling this. I thought this was a cutscene. God, that's a good burger. I will say this. Your boy really knows how to make a burger. <sighs> what does that say? Oh, I have a rear view mirror too. Oh fuck. I forgot cars cars function completely different. Say. Back up. Oh dear. No, we're gonna crash into a tree because we can. Oh no, no we can't. Alright, fuck it. Let's go. Good atmosphere so far, not gonna lie. I like the vibes, although it's not particularly spooky, besides the fact that it's at night. Let's see if we can crash. Yes, we can! <laughs> Crazy, bro. All right. <laughs> <coughs> Thank you for programming that into the game. It's funny as fuck. I gotta take my headphones off for a second. I'm gonna pour some more milk and I'm gonna come back. All right, milk is down, and I am sitting back a down. All right, my brother Ethan. What? You, you fuck! Oh, God damn it! Let's try this again. <sighs> what the fuck? Where did that happen?
So yeah, I know, but uh, life's just really fucking chaotic right now. It's crazy. Trees are pretty. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I, I didn't learn my lesson. I should park at this gas station. Ask if they saw my brother. Okay. <laughs> I was kind of expecting it to explode. I don't know why. Ooh. Oh. Oh, there's a thunderstorm going on outside of my apartment. So far, this is not giving me like an October vibe. Oh, well, I guess it kind of is. Like October 31st, 2023 in like Toledo, Ohio. I just... What do you want? I'm searching for my brother. He went missing while hike. Fuck. I'm searching for my brother. He went missing while hiking in this area. Sorry to offend you, pal, but that's not my problem. Also, you shouldn't just randomly approach people like this, especially in this area. What do you mean? Hey, look, man. I worked pretty late. I just want to grab some snacks and beers and drive home. Don't fucking drink them while you're driving, you son of a bitch. I'm not in the mood to talk with people. I don't... <laughs> I'm making him sound like a demon, but honestly pretty relatable. I'm not in the mood to talk with people I don't know. Me on Friday after working all day. I understand. Sorry for bothering you. You annoyed the business. <laughs> You get a fucking achievement for that? Jesus Christ. What can I do for you, sir? I'm searching for my brother. He was... Hi fuck. I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking around this area. He should have come home yesterday. Have you seen him? How does your brother look... What? How does your brother look like? That's not good English. What? How does your brother look like? He has brown hair and is pretty tall. He is a gr He also has a green backpack. Let me think for a second. <laughs> um, yes, I think I saw your brother. He came in here and bought a few things. Some water and a few snacks. You're trying to find him? Have you told the police already? Yes, I did in fact. But they said they don't have the resources for a search right now. They, they said they only search. They said they only search for a person if they. God damn it. My brain. They said they only search for. They said they only. <laughs> God damn it. They said they only start a search if a. Fuck. Damn it, if this doesn't tell you that I have a fucking learning disability, I don't know what will. They said they only start a search if a person has been missing for more than 48 hours. Jesus Christ. Come on, Lord Ludacris, do better than that. It isn't the, f it isn't the first time someone went missing in this area. At least a handful of people went missing there in the last decade. People talk a lot. I've heard rumors that there are strange screams and weird noises coming from the woods. So, you should be careful, especially going there at this time of night. There's a road right back behind the gas station leading to the mountain. Make sure to stay on it. There could be dangerous wildlife in that area. Thanks. I'll make sure to stay safe. Take care. 
Can I buy some uh, cigarettes and milk so I can come home to my kids? Why do you look like you're getting ready to beat off? And he's just like, oh, should I should I start beating off here? The answer is no. You should never beat off inside a store like that. Okay, let's get back in the car. I'm assuming that's what we're supposed to do. Or not. Okay, that's why we have the flashlight. I was just about to start exploring there on my own. And I figured, you know what? Hey, it said road, so they probably want me to blah 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 blah. Get in the fucking car and do shit. Oh, if you hear any creaks, that's my uh, my TV table. I apologize. I game on my couch in my living room. I like how the snow is super bright. Very charming. All right, you know what? I kind of want to know what happens if you go off the road. You know what? Maybe I don't. Maybe I, I kind of do. What are the controls? All right, so there's no jump, there's no crouch, there's no zoom. I'm assuming mouse one is used. That's what it is in these horror games, usually. But, I don't know. I don't even know if I need the flashlight. So I'm gonna keep it on. Just for your guys' sake. Man, the lightning is really going to town out there. It's, uh, pretty crazy. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna plug my fucking phone in. Just in case we lose power. That would be really fucking annoying. And okay, so there's something over here. My brother's tent looks entirely different. I should take a closer look. No. Bye. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh Oh hi! <laughs> Whoa, whoa, who the fuck are you? You scared the shit out of me. I scared you? I almost had a heart attack myself. What do you want? I hope you're not some kind of pervert or creep. I I'm not. I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking in this area. Have you seen him? Nope, I haven't seen him. Wait. You don't even know what he looks like. Look, man, I'm just some guy that likes to hike in the woods and sleep in a tent in freezing conditions. <laughs> That's not fucking English. In a woods. <laughs> I haven't seen anyone in days. I understand. You're planning to go deeper into the forest? <sighs> yes, I'll... S yes, I'll search around the area. I hope I can find my brother, or at least traces of him. Look, you'll probably think I'm a stoner or something, but last night I had my tent a bit up north, and I heard weird noises coming from the woods. It sounded like a child was crying. Oh fuck! But I didn't. But I didn't see anything. It creeped me out. Maybe it was just a cryptid. <laughs> Maybe it was just a cryptid. I don't know. Holy fuck that lightning was really bright Yeah, maybe it was just a fucking cryptid. I don't know. It's just mothman. He's just coming to kill us uh, No, no need to worry about that Fucking idiot. Oh What? Look man, do you carry? <laughs> Jesus Christ this dude is a stoner What do you mean? I'm talking about a piece, you know. Oh, oh, he's asking if I got a gun. Yeah, that's, uh, that's... <laughs> God damn it. I'm talking about protection. You know, something for protection. 
You mean a gun? No, I don't. <laughs> then you shouldn't be here in the first place. It's way too dangerous to go deeper into the forest at night. But I'm not going to stop you. Yeah, you're damn right. I just wanna... <laughs> I just wanna sleep now. Also, one last thing. Don't creep up on... Don't, don't... Don't... Fuck! That's not English! Don't creep up a tent in the woods at night ever again. I almost would've shot you. Give me your fucking gun then, you piece of shit. Well, I'm... Well, I guess I'm glad you didn't. Me too. Good luck with the search. Hey, I know this is America. Don't catch you slipping up. I got a strap. <clears throat> I got to carry him. I thought he said this was his brother's tent. Or did I fucking misread that? I said, where's the fucking road, dude? Where's the fucking road, man? This way? Or did the road? No, it's over here. It's probably gonna be. It's okay. The baby crying is probably just some horror beyond uh, my imagination. I'll give me nightmares and shit. You know, an always run button in this game would have been great if there's no stamina meter. Actually, no. I tend to like... I'm one of the few people that I think really likes holding the shift button down to run. I mean, for some games, you shouldn't have it like Quake. Quake does not need a sprint function. But I really think Jedi, like, Jedi Outcast and Jedi Academy should have had a walk and then a run button. But I mean, I understand why it's not there. Um, because, um, you have force speed. It's kind of like sprint. God, I've been playing the, I haven't played Jedi Academy, like, way too much recently. But you know what? Who the fuck cares? I'm having fun. Is that a fucking figure in the distance, like, right over here? I can't tell. All I know... And I'm calling this right now. This motherfucker that I'm playing as is going to die at the end of the story. Calling it right now. I also kind of want to know what game engine this this uses because uh, it feels like Unity. It's getting really cold. I should set up my tent on the left side of the road. I'm at the right. A poopy I should set up I'm on the left side of the road I'm on the left side of the road dude I'm on the left that's probably my phone telling me that um it's about to rain yeah I'm I'm aware expected to stop press E to enter tent okay It's cold, but I'm falling asleep slowly. There's a noise. Roar! <laughs> hey, hey, do you got any cigarettes? I ran out. I think I heard someone scream. Really? Because I didn't hear shit. I'm not sure if it was real or imagined. I need to check. It could be my brother screaming for help. Jesus Christ, the lightning here is crazy. Yeah, this motherfucker's gonna die. How do you? Oh, there it is. I should turn the volume up a little bit. I'm gonna fucking regret that mistake. By the way, um, all of you that are watching, if you're ever in this situation in real life, don't. Just leave. This is guaranteed death. I have a feeling I'm supposed to be going towards this light. 
I have a feeling that's also going to kill me. But considering this is an, a real game, and if something tries to hit to uh, hurt me in real life, I got a fucking hammer next to me. Not because I'm scared, but because I was um, I was doing some shit with tools earlier. Okay, so that's the game telling- oh, I was gonna say God telling me. It's not God, it's the game. The game is telling me to turn my flashlight off. Boogity, 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 boogity. I was really expecting a, a fucking monster. Oh, look, a, a creepy cabin. It's all fenced off. That probably has no way to get in there. <clears throat> Carcass? brother's backpack. He must have been here. Weird. Backpack is completely empty. Nothing in here. We found the backpack. Okay. Cuckoo. Cuckoo, 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 cuckoo. Oh, oh, am I gonna go in here? That's a fucking bad idea. Oh, man. If there's anything any movie has told me ever, don't go into creepy fucking houses in the middle of the woods. You just, you know what? I don't think there's a good option. Keep the door open or closed. Jesus Christ. Well, at least it's uh, it's actually kind of spooking me. It's making me feel uneasy. So good on you, game. Good atmosphere. Um, what the fuck am I supposed to be doing here, though? Uh, uh, e to inspect. What the hell? Someone made a picture of my tent. In my car. Your <laughs> That's it? Oh, that was pretty good. And honestly, for something like that, that's pretty accurate. <coughs> <coughs> that actually, that jump scare got me at the end. I will say that. Um, yeah, so that's the missing hiker. I'm going to check to see if there's any, uh, alternate endings, but it was a pretty good game. It made me feel uneasy at the end. And, uh, I liked the twist where it wasn't a fucking monster. It was just people. It was just killers. I think that's pretty cool. I have not seen a single other indie horror game do that. So good on ya. All right. This is Lord Ludacris signing off. Bye.